Nicole Bercy from Transat. This is such a pleasure for me because we haven't had a chance to talk about Transat directly in quite a while. And uh, you've got your training academies that are starting in Toronto this evening. So lots of Transat information to be um, given out to the travel advisors. So we have a first crack at you. What are you going to be discussing? Yeah, so tonight is a really big night for us. We're super excited about it. And I would say one of our most important messages that we're giving to travel agents tonight is about all the tools and the self-service functions that we've introduced or reintroduced during COVID to make it easier for an agent to manage a file um, because it is still a little bit challenging, uh, not going to lie, uh, to get through to the call center. So the more we can do to help facilitate um, independence for the travel right. consultant, I think is really welcome and absolutely needed. Such a big issue still in the industry, right? I mean, we've talked about this with yourself and with other uh, tour operators, airlines, that the phone lines are, it's hard to get through to the call center. So I know people like yourselves have been putting together these tools. Now, are agents using them and what are they? So let's let's get into that a little bit more. Sure. You know, there are certainly a lot of agents that welcome this type of technology and completely embrace it. Because why would anybody willingly sit on hold <laughs> when you didn't have to, right? But we still have to find a really smooth way to get the message out to those that are maybe not the early adopters of technology. Right. Um, and also, there's still a lot of new people coming into the industry or returning after oh, having been okay. off, right? So we can't take it for granted the fact that we launched something uh, even in September last year, that these new people have gone back and read old messaging from Transat, right? In a perfect world, sure, they would live and breathe Transat, but uh, they've got a lot of things coming at them. So we understand that that's not always the case. So this is a great opportunity for us to speak about this in a large audience. So we are expecting uh, about 350 people tonight. So imagine all those agents are going to go home with uh, at least a few nuggets of information from us. It, it will really help because there are certainly times when an agent absolutely has to call Transat. Um, you know, their file is complicated or for whatever reason, it's not a product that you can book in the system yourself. The problem is, if a lot of agents are calling about things that they could do on their own, it means our call center agents are tied up with those sorts of uh, inquiries. So we need to free up the time so the call center agent is available when an agent really truly has to call us. So I would, to your question of are people using it? Yes maybe not 100% um, to the level that we would like, but each week is better than the week before. And that's all we can hope for, right? Tools, online tools, technology, you can change a name, I presume, things of that nature. Yeah. Exactly. Change name, put payment on a file. There's also forms like if you want to pay a file with a future travel credit, um, there's a form for that. There's customer service forms. So it's really, we look at every call that comes into the call center and ask ourselves, is there something IT could develop for us? Or is there a form that we could um, make it so that a travel agent can just give us the information without calling in? Unfortunately, it's not 100% of the time, but when it is possible, we will do it. Um, right. You know, we are here to help the travel agents as much as we can. The bottom line is we need people. So if anyone wants to be a call center agent in Transat, uh, we're welcoming resumes. Absolutely. <laughs> it's a great team. It's a great place to work. It's a great place to be. Um, but it has been, uh, the, the recruitment has been challenging as it has been for a lot. Uh, you know, having known you for just a couple of years, um, I know the passion that you have for the business and for helping advisors. So when you talk about these tools, I know that you're certainly being really honest with the community because that's your life. And, and of course, as you say, there's this um, halo effect. If, it, if they use the tools, then the call center is freer for the complicated files. So yeah, it makes a lot of sense. Now let's talk about product. Um, I, I don't know what to expect from you for the winter. Yeah, so it's going to be a really exciting year and advanced sales are looking really good. Yay. Groups is busy again, you know, it's a lot of the tried and true destinations as people return to traveling. Um, but this is exactly what Transat excels in, you know, it's uh, if you've got a client that's looking for um, an easy beach vacation, you don't need to look anywhere else. <laughs> Come to Transat. We've also, uh, um, 
you know, looking to expand our Winter Europe program, which is exciting for us. So tonight's academy will, of course, focus a lot on the South, but there's also information about our Winter uh, Europe programming. And uh, yeah, the winter is, is looking quite, uh, quite good for us. We finished up the um, uh, last winter on quite a positive note, but still challenging. Um, and the summer's been quite good. And really, it's... It, it, it's great. It's great to have that optimistic vibe again. And a lot of agents, while they are super busy, um, you can see it in their emotions and in the way they're interacting with us that there is certainly a lot more optimism than there has been. Oh, that's so great to hear. Honestly, we're all in our little silos at home and um, you have your finger on the pulse. You're out there talking to people. So, and you're, you're obviously your BDMs are bringing feedback. So um, I'm so good. <laughs> I'm so excited to hear that the, that the vibe is back out there. Right. And you'll, you'll get a sense of it this evening, obviously. And as you travel across the country, where else are you going to be? So Quebec uh, has three shows in, in the province of Quebec after uh, they start tomorrow. And then we're off to uh, Nova Scotia for our Halifax launch. And then this year, because we know not everyone is going to be able to join us in person um, because we have scaled down the number of shows that uh, we are offering. We are broadcasting part of the presentation live on our Facebook group, Follow Your Transat Sales Team, which is something new for us to try. Um, so we'll see how that goes. And we get a lot of great feedback on our Facebook group. So I'm sure agents will let help uh, help us improve upon that in the future but um, our BDRs are so excited to get out <laughs> and see as many yeah. travel agents as possible our sales manager Lindsay it's uh, it, it, she's really looking forward to it and as you know Nina at Transat we're very focused on helping travel agents and we've got our inside sales team and our, our BDRs that work as a cohesive team to help agents so just reminding agents and introducing them to the inside sales people as well is really helpful um, our groups team is fantastic they're going to join us at the events a few people from the groups department so it's it's an important night in so yes. many ways. It's also the kickoff to us celebrating our 35th anniversary at Transat. So I know you were just a wee last 35 years ago, Nina, <laughs> um, but uh, Transat's uh, pretty excited. And like I said, it's the kickoff of a, of a year long celebration. You know, we like to stretch out celebrations as much as we can. So it's not, uh, it's not just this month that we'll be doing activities, but agents I think will be quite pleased with what we have in store for them um, as we celebrate. Oh, I'm looking forward to hearing about that. Congratulations. Happy birthday. Happy anniversary. And thank you so much for the messaging that Transat is uh, back as strong as ever. And um, the tools. We have to underline the tools. Use the tools. Okay. Absolutely. Thank you, Nicole. Thank you, Nina. Take care.